Hey guys, how you doing today? Uh, we have a new coin coming out from the U.S. Mint later this year. It is the American Liberty 225th Anniversary Gold Coin, which was unveiled uh, today, uh, earlier today. Uh, it says, kicking off a year-long celebration of its 225th anniversary, the United States Mint unveiled the 2017 American Liberty High Relief Gold Coin in a ceremony today at the Department of Treasury in Washington, D.C. So let's take a look. Oh, nice, very nice. Images of the obverse, edge, and reverse of the 1792-2017, so it's dual dated, American Liberty 225th Anniversary Gold Coin, and I believe it's four nines, one ounce, four nines, so it's going to be soft gold. you got to be careful, you know, uh, don't jiggle the thing in the, in the airtight when you get it. I'm sure many of you who bought the first one will want this one and, and and from what I can see here I think this one looks better than the first one right so let's read on here highlights of the 20, 225th anniversary coin include an ounce of 49 fine gold an increased level of detail a proof finish well that's good so it's going to be a PR or a PF um, designation for the coin if you're going to get it slabbed uh, raised edge lettering with stars and a 1792-2017 dual date. Very good. Then there is the design. Its obverse or head side depicts Liberty as an African-American woman facing left, uh, wearing a crown of stars in the homage to the bronze statue of freedom topping the dome of the U.S. Capitol. So here it is. It's kind of the same there and the same here, okay? Representing the traditional hopeful idea, ideas of liberty while offering a hint of the possibilities that the future may hold. U.S. Mint Artistic Infusion Program designer Justin Coons created the portrait with, while U.S. Mint sculptor engraver Phoebe Hemphill sculpted it. The initials JK and PH appear on the design along with surrounding inscriptions of liberty, the years 1792 and 2017, and the motto in God we trust. Now, um, for those of you who didn't know, there was some type of like unveiling and it was recorded uh, or shall we say live streamed and now they have a recording of that live stream. Um, I will leave the link in the description uh, box down below if you want to watch it and I'll show you just a little glimpse of it. So it's about 26 minutes long. I did not watch this. I just kind of like skipped through this different people coming up and talking about the coin. And maybe she's one of the people that designed it. So, um, you know, you guys could take a look if you want more of the details with regards to this coin. So let's continue on with the coin. That's the full uh, obverse depiction of the coin. Very nice. Um, closer look at the coin okay so the reverse or tail side depicts an american eagle in flight with cir circling inscriptions of united states of america e pluribus unum 100 dollars and one ounce four nine fine gold toward the bottom left has the w mint mark for west point all right that's a very nice eagle there you know the u.s coins always have great eagles it just that's just the way it is you know and initials of C CTC and MG complete the artwork representing U.S. Mint Artistic Infusion Program designer Chris T. Costello and U.S. Mint sculptor engraver Michael Gadiso. I don't know how to say that. Gadisioso. I don't know. So um, there's a lot of people involved in designing the coin. I mean, it like, sounds like it's four people. And um, yeah, it's a high relief. Uh, 13. It says, yeah, adding to its collectible appeal, edges of the high relief gold coin show raised lettering of 225th anniversary and 13 five point stars. Um, so, uh, this coin, I'm like, oh, I wonder, I wonder if they're going to make the silver one, right? And down below, as I was reading here, it says, um, the 24 karat gold coin is scheduled to launch sometime this spring, which is not too far away. Then the companion silver medals with the same design should follow by summertime. So that means they're going to have the silver version. Uh, I don't know what the mintage is going to be, but those coins blew up big time 
last year when they sold the 2016 version of it of the 2015 gold coin so we'll have to wait and see how that turns out and most people aren't going to be able to buy the one ounce so people want the uh, the one ounce gold coin so they're going to want the metal and you know i wanted the metal but you know that just sold out right um because they only made 12,500 each for the west point and the san francisco one so uh the first 2015 liberty gold eagle this one here sold around 49,000 coins right and we'll see what happens with the liberty metal here's the silver one now these sold out in like within the first five or ten minutes i mean it was like bye bye so that's what we got i still don't have this coin <laughs> but hopefully uh for those of you who are collecting these you get a chance to get both of them right at least one of them okay so thanks for watching guys if you have any comments questions just leave them down below and i will get back to you guys